Now, what <laughs> immediately I had told Kurt is that this basically is Chinese food. Obviously, he did mention it's Chinese food, but this feels like food you can get at any Chinese restaurant, but I have a feeling it's not quite the same. So I'm interested to see what makes this different. In this episode of Big Bites, we are in a familiar spot. If you've never heard of this spot, then have you been living under a rock? This is Heliconia. This is a place where you can get good vibes, great food, and of course, we're here to try all of that, the food especially. But before we get into that episode, I'd like to thank our sponsors for this episode, Ghana Beverages Incorporated and Turbo energy drink. The last time Joshua tossed this in my face. Joshua, what you got for me? Hope! Oh, hopefully that'll get us going. It really is going. Thank you for shaking that up, Joshua. But I have it safely in my arms right now and I'm just gonna take a quick sip. Mm. Ah. Hey Joshua, think quick. <laughs> anyway, so Ghana Beverages Incorporated has a promotion going on right now. You can win two CPL tickets to the finals. Also, they're giving away tickets to matches throughout the season. What do you gotta do? Watch Big Bites. Comment below, let me know what you love about Big Bites and also what you love about Turbo Energy Drink and Guyana Beverages Incorporated, right? And also, also, they're giving away a free basket, a goodie basket full of things from Guyana Beverages Incorporated. And included in that basket is Turbo energy drink. Again, what you gotta do, what you gotta do, watch Big Bites. That's what you gotta do. Watch Big Bites, comment below, tell me what you love about this episode. And the folks over at Ghana Beverages Incorporated, they're watching. Also, I'd like to thank Ministry of Culture, Youth and Sport. Ghana Cricket Carnival is coming up, and that is something you're not gonna wanna miss either. Without further ado, that was a mouthful. I am out of breath. Let's go and talk to Kurt. What is Heliconia really? Heliconia is an experience mm -hmm. where you come and you enjoy the whole a variety of food, drinks, great customer service. We have excellent bartenders, we have good hosts, good servers, you know, the ambience. We're located in the heart of the city. Mm -hmm. A lot of people consider us like a hideout. That wasn't our intention, but that's what we started to, to be known as, right. as a hideout because we're in the Etel building, on the ground floor, mm -hmm. in the building of the churches. So I'm looking at this drink right here and um, it's called an AMF. So this is one of the many drinks you can get here at Heliconia. If you don't know what AMF is... Too young to be drinking. <laughs> you're too young to be drinking <laughs> yeah, if you don't know what it is. Exactly. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Okay. I, I, I just tasted it and your bartender asked me if I wanted um, hard, soft, whatever. And I said hard, always. <laughs> <laughs> At Heliconio, it's all about our guests, it's all about our clients. Our purpose is to satisfy our guests. Tell us about the food we're going to try here today. Usually we have a lunch special that happens Monday through Friday. Mm -hmm. And every day uh, we have a different, we have different menu items. Mm -hmm. Today we're going to try some long ming, the fried rice. And then we're going to do some sweet and sour chicken. You know, keep it very simple, you know, we just keeping the public in suspense. So we have an <laughs> awesome, awesome Chinese menu that is available from next Monday. That is cooked by non-Asians. Right? That is, so that is interesting. Asian chef. That is interesting. And it's all local, it's all done by Guyanese. That is our Wednesday. Wednesday. Our Wednesday menu. We have jerk Fridays. Mm -hmm. So everything jerk on Fridays. Thursdays, everything curry. You get curried beef, curry pork, curry mm -hmm. fish. You get dal, roti, white rice. You got, you got the full works Yo, here. Everything crazy on Thursdays because yeah. it's curry Thursdays. And on the menu varies um, yeah. every morning about 7.30. Mm -hmm. Our menu is posted. Follow Heliconia on Facebook. Yes. yes. All right, so we got our first dish. We're going to start with this one. This is the char siu pork with chow mein. 
So the chow mein, you've got your broccoli, you've got your pak choy, you've got your bora, you've got your standard. You know what chow mein is, we've all had chow mein, right? Of course, you got a char siu pork on top. Now, what <laughs> immediately I had told Kurt is that this basically is Chinese food. Obviously, he did mention it's Chinese food, but this feels like food you can get at any Chinese restaurant, but I have a feeling it's not quite the same. So I'm interested to see what makes this different. So we're gonna take our first big bite of this meal. That's a decently sized bite. Let's give it a try. All right, immediately, I'm gonna tell you, this is not your typical food you would get at a Chinese, right? If I had to describe it, I would say this is how Chinese would taste if it went gourmet. <laughs> This, um, okay, first of all, pork is absolutely different. I don't, I can't describe this taste. It, it's very, they, they captured that Asian flavor. It's soft, it's tender. Normally, you're accustomed to when you bite into a piece of pork, it tastes a bit rubbery and a bit hard. It is so soft, so tender, so juicy and chewy. I'm also tasting that sesame seed oil. No spices in there all intermingling. Oh, God. Yeah, this is really good. It was really good, Kurt. The noodles do have a nice stiffness to it as well. It's not very soft. And I know a lot of people tend to like their, their noodles super tender, but I actually don't care for it. I like it when my noodles have a bit of stiffness to it. A little bit of, um, not so much crunch, but it's al dente, right? You're right, it's al dente, cooked well. All right, let's move on to the next dish. So right now, we have sweet and sour chicken. Uh, I've had a lot of sweet and sour chicken in my life. It is one of the things that I order from when I go to Chinese restaurants. So let's see if Heliconia does it justice. Big bite. Should I take two or just go like with one? Let me see if I, nah, let me, let me. Okay, this is a big piece. This is a big bite, right? This is a big bite, let's go. That was weird. First thing I, did you use chili in this? Right, right, right. That was actually the first thing I picked up. Chili. This is, okay, so you're definitely tasting the sweet and sour. No doubt about it, no question, sweet and sour chicken, right? But the little punch you're getting from chili, from the chili peppers, that is what is getting to me right now. This is addictive. This is something that once you start eating, you're not gonna wanna stop eating it. Like, jeez. My God, this is so good. You turn me into Bruce Lee right now. This is Asian food. My God, this thing is bussin' bussin'. Like for real, for real. So this is our last dish, right? This dish, at first glance, looks like your regular chicken fried rice that you would get from any Chinese, right? There is absolutely little difference from what you would get. L looks wise, it looks like Chinese. Like if you could buy it out of Chinese food, take it out of the box and put it in this plate. Not gonna lie to y'all. But from what we've learned from the past two dishes is that flavor is what's, is the game here. The flavor is what's important. So we're gonna give this a try and see how different it is from what you would get at your just your average Chinese because so far they've convinced me they know how to do Asian cuisine. I didn't think they could, but they did it. So let's go and take a big bite. Let's see if I can get a piece of this chicken first. Nice, so we got your uh, chicken and fried rice. Let's go, big bite. So immediately, I can tell you, that scent, as soon as it hits you in your face, that's the first thing you notice, the how fragrant the rice is. It is Asian, but not what you're accustomed to, I'm sure. You're not gonna find this exact, this flavor profile in any Chinese restaurant or wherever you go, and that's a good thing because you want difference, you want uniqueness, and Heliconia offers that uniqueness right now. The chicken, on point. There's a nice teriyaki. I'm tasting that flavor profile there. Outside is nice and crunchy. I'm inside, it's not dry at all. It's super moist. The rice cooked to perfection. Oh God, this is, this is addictive. Ginger, I picked up the ginger. So good. You're gonna wanna add this place to your list because the food is absolutely worth it. And if this is any indication about the rest of their menu, because this is just a sneak peek of what you can expect when you come here. They do everything justice and capture the essence of what each cuisine is. Asian, Indian, whatever it is, they've got it 
on lock right here at Heliconia. So you're gonna wanna come check it out for yourself and tell them Norman sent you, obviously. And of course, they got the different specials. They got their um, wine, steak, and jazz night. And of course, every day they got a rum special, an XM rum special where you buy one and get one free. So those are things you can expect when you come here. Guys, before we go off on this episode of Big Bites, I wanna thank our sponsor, Gana Beverages Incorporated, for their turbo energy drink. Also, they have got a CPL promotion going on right now where you have the chance to win two tickets to the CPL finals. And also, they're giving away tickets throughout this season for games. So, all you got to do is watch Big Bites and you can get the chance to win these tickets. All right. Also, also there's one more thing from them. They're giving away. You, know, you, you heard this from me, right? You heard this here first. They're giving away a basket. A basket full of goodies from Ghana Beverages Incorporated. All again, all you gotta do is watch every episode of Big Bites. You got like the, from this episode, just comment below, and you have a chance to win a basket of Ghana Beverages goodies, which will include Turbo Energy Drink. So another reason why you should watch Big Bites. Also remember the Ministry of Culture, Youth and Sport, Cricket Carnival. Thank you guys so much for coming on board this episode as well. This has been Big Bites, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a like, give it a share, give it, give it your comments, send it to your mother, grandmother, send it to your father, send it to your brother, send it to the coworker you hate. I'm talking to you, Roxanne. <laughs> so, until next time, this has been Big Bites. Take Big Bites only. This is something I need to address some big bites. It, it, it personally hurts me. Y'all say I just enjoy everything. But why would I go to a place when I know the food ain't good? <laughs> Come on. Think about it, guys. Think about it. This food is bussing. Oh my gosh. Don't watch me. I eat it now. Don't watch me. I eat it now. I eat it now.